Sup? New haircut? Yeah, man. Every day. Get my haircut every day. You know how it is. Wet hair moment. Good to know it's greasy. It's at like 95 degrees outside in St. Louis. It's uh awful. And it's humid as shit. Let me get you an accurate depiction. Let me look at my weather app. 94 and feels like 104. We get snow sometimes though, guys. So global warming is not real. Anyway, it's good to see you guys. It's crime time. We're going to be watching a 90 minute video about what to what it's like to interrogate an obsessive psychopath. It's from Stranger Stories again. Uh, once again, I don't watch these videos in advance. We watch these blind with you so we can experience this together. Once again, this is some sensitive stuff. So if you're sensitive to like people committing crimes that are like fairly heinous, I don't know the exact triggers of the video. Like I said, we do these things blindly because it's fun to experience them together. So... Yeah, I don't. We talked on Tuesday. Holy so it's shit. Been, I mean, this is crispy. The week that we've been working on this. Today, we're going to see what happens when a toxic relationship turns deadly. In April of 2017, several Amish children were out riding their horses, enjoying the warm spring day. Mm. Their outing was brought to an abrupt halt when they discovered the decomposing remains of a man. Fuck. The body turned out to be that of Jeremy Barron, who mm. had been shot five times that's police turned their attention to his girlfriend ashley hoth hoth had a criminal record with alcohol and marijuana related charges as well as numerous traffic violations including trying to run over someone with her car while her children were with her jesus she had been charged with domestic violence and while on meth her six-year-old nearly drowned while she slept hoth was friends with an older man jay clark clark was obsessed with hoth and hated Baron, not only having a relationship with her, but for being abusive towards Hoth, yeah, causing I where her this is going. lose custody of her children. On February 8, 2017, Hoth and Clark went for a drive with Baron under the pretext of picking up drugs. Clark, having been steadily manipulated to believe that this is what Hoth wanted, ended up shooting Baron. Evidence suggests that Hoth shot Baron at least once as well. I was wondering if you guys were going to come back yeah, or not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Quite a bit of information has come out. Okay. Okay. We've um, both through obviously talking to people and also some uh, forensic type evidence, mm -hmm. things of that nature. Um, the reason that we brought you back in today, mm -hmm. okay, is to give you the opportunity to truly tell us what happened. Okay. Okay. And just understand. All right, I'll admit all week it. To work this, <laughs> we've got evidence. We've talked to people. Okay. So I want to give you the opportunity to tell us what really happened, okay? Because I think that, um, unfortunately, you've got yourself in a tough position with the kids and with everything that's going on. Um, I know that Jeremy was kind of a uh, big reason you got your kids taken away. Mm -hmm. I think he was almost off the... Yeah. Yeah. Because the relationship, yeah, could be off. You know, and unfortunately, from talking to people, it sounds like um, he was not going to let you go easy. No, it was very yeah, I wonder why. away from Jeremy. It had been a long two years, and uh, I did go to the shelter in Colorado before, and then I just I couldn't stay there no longer, and I had to go back. I didn't have anywhere else to go, and that's why they were took. Um, it it was it was rough with Jeremy. Was really how this guy's rough. just like well, you know, obviously you've got him awkwardly you know, not sitting at the table, yeah. like in you the know, corner of got, the room. I, I don't. What a weird. I think that a lot of the reasons. What a weird got spot. So involved in the drugs was because of Jeremy. Yeah, when I was there, I didn't. I mean, there was no choice whether to or not to do them. Like there. It you was, had to do. I it. had. To. Right. It was a really bad situation. You had to do the drugs. Had. Um. A while, like a year and a half or so, like after you know, still being there, it it did get less abusive physically or you know because he was insane when i first met him like okay. just crazy like what um just evil like i, I don't know if you know willard they know he was crazy. Just, yeah, we know super, willard willard, willard. willard, willard, willard yeah, yeah. I mean, he was super abusive i mean i don't I, it was tough okay what did he do you know like just stuff to like bad stuff yeah uh just, uh 
Yeah. I mean, anybody and everybody around. It wasn't just me. Like, he... He would fight everybody? He would just... I don't know. It was... Uh, he... He would just put them down. Uh... Hoth starts out painting the victim as abusive and violent. Do you wonder and why? he and his friends seem to be well known to the police, which backs up her claims. Hoth may be going for a case of self-defense mm. gone wrong. Crazy mad. Crazy, crazy mad. Um... It was it was just insane. I don't even know how to describe it. It was just nuts. I wonder why you um, can't describe it. And it, it didn't. It did get better from that, but I I was scared a lot. Um, and but I learned to just escape. You know, just turn his back, turn, just run, and I did that a lot. Okay. Um, and obviously that puts you in a pretty desperate situation. Yeah. Um, I did when the kids were took. I moved out to Angie's. Um, and I had to leave there because he wouldn't quicker on the room, so then I did go to the shelter. Uh, but I did still go back, and I had been seeing him. Okay. Um, and then when I also moved to the apartment. Okay. But it wasn't, it wasn't Murph like from every day. Because from Practical was, Jokers is convinced over here, dude. It was very tough because I did learn, like, it, I... I ended, I ended up caring for this man very, very much. Right, yeah. Um, so you could love like, somebody and be afraid of him at the same time. Right. Yeah. So he wasn't around as much, and when he was around, he was he was a jerk. Mm -hmm. um, but, the, you know, he, he went to jail and he came out. I mean, everything I told you, that, I mean, that's what happened. Came out? Good for him. Ashley, hmm. this is your one and only chance. I'm going to tell you right now. Oh, my I God. Understand Listen that. to me. Okay. Mm -hmm. You didn't think we'd be watching you? you okay. Where do you work at? Burger King? Do you know it's audio and video recorded at Burger King? Yeah. Okay. Conversation you had by the specialty board? Wouldn't her dumbass be like, yeah, I fucking Did killed you him? Were there? When it happened? You better start thinking about. This is me. This Are you me. serious, okay. dude? This is serious. Okay. Okay. I've been watching you. Okay. <laughs> you need to tell us. What occurred there? Guess so. You admitted <laughs> to being there. No, I didn't. You I said I was Are you serious? This is serious. I saw him stop right. looking for him, <laughs> and that basically he was he was shot. He was dead. That was it. You want to know what you told, what you said at work? Hmm. I was there when the guy shot him, and you don't want to know who it is because he's done it before and got away with it. <laughs> so obviously, at this point, we're as worried about you as we are anybody else in this situation. You and I both know that this guy has done this before. And there's, I mean, honestly, if you were... It's already an interesting one. The only person that knew I'd done something wrong, something that would put me in prison for the rest of my life, I would kill you. Okay? Mm -hmm. And obviously he's threatened you, correct? This is some pandering and a half. I totally get it, yeah. <laughs> we are here for you. Right. I don't want to see something happen to you, and I am, I am truly. Honestly, it doesn't surprise me coming from a cop, but whatever. Not hesitate to pull the trigger again. They may or may not be all that concerned, but it's a good tactic to make Hoth worry for her own safety, especially if she thinks she might be able to make some sort of deal in exchange for testifying. We'll see what happened next after a quick word from today's sponsor. Uh, today's sponsor is um, my fat ass. <laughs> This is, this is your opportunity to tell us what happened so that we can keep you safe, okay? We're way past I wasn't there. We're way past I don't know what happened to Jeremy, okay? We're way past that. So let's, let's, let's leave that back. You did kind of okay? say you directly recorded her admitting to being there, so. Um, hello? Oh, no. Not being yeah, caught admitting to murder. Before. I'm gonna cry. I can't imagine, like you said, you cared for him. You it did. was so traumatic when I shot him. <laughs> oh no, I'm sniffling. I'm so sad. What am I gonna do? The police don't believe my crocodile tears. What a dangerous situation for me. The suspect. <laughs> oh no. I don't think you pulled the trigger. 
I did at least once. I even I said that. Help us understand. We're, we can put you there. Gee, I wonder why you can put her there. It's almost you like she admitted it you're there. in a recorded space. You didn't pull the trigger. We need to understand that. Otherwise, it looks like you did. Oh, no. That toilet paper? Here you go. Wipe your shit. <laughs> Wipe the shit coming out of your mouth. Fucking dick. I don't think you expected it to go as far as it did. No, I didn't. No. I don't think you expected him to do what he did. <laughs> yeah, I did it. All I did was. T all I did was. All I did was ask him to kill him and then. And then, and then he did, and then I didn't know how he did, and then I also took the gun and shot him and helped him kill him, and then I don't even know how he did that. Why would he do that? <laughs> Has he threatened you? If you say anything? I'm sure she'll say yes. can't say that. I'm so scared. Me, the accomplice, terrified. Well, wow, this is real exhilarating. This girl's being proper. She's being smart in an interrogation room because she's not speaking, but it's too late because her dumbass admitted to it to somebody public I guess what I would ask is to think about your kids I, I am I don't know what are to you? say I'm scared I know you're scared we believe you <laughs> I know you're scared, scared but we don't really care do you understand that this is your opportunity to tell us what happened okay <laughs> what's gonna happen to me like I just don't uh probably Jill I understand you gotta tell yeah, us my kids I don't want my kids <laughs> we need to have this person put away this person cannot be walking the same streets as your kids. That no, this person is her, by the way. They're talking about her. That person cannot. <laughs> is that a, the type of person you They're being so wrong? vague about it, but it's 100% her. Is they're talking the about. Point? This this person can't be out. This person, who's definitely not you as well, can't be present. We can't allow this person, who's also not you at all, definitely not, to to uh, be free. And it's not you. Trust me. Super not. Uh, oh, God. It happened, okay? What was going to happen to me? Like, I just don't, I'm scared. I, don't well, I understand. You got to tell yeah, us. my kids. I don't want my kids. We need to have this person put away. This person cannot be walking the same streets as your kids. talking about her. No, what, what? what was that? That person cannot. Is that a, the type of person you want your kids around? <laughs> no. Because that's the type All right, of well, you're under arrest then. <laughs> well, what if it's not just that person I would have to worry about? How do I know that my kids are here with me? Well, here's the thing. We in here's the thing. You go to jail, and they are. Give us, <laughs> you know, your side of it. We we don't know everybody that's involved. We don't know what's going on. Okay, mm -hmm. our primary concern is, you know, I'll be honest. My primary concern. We have situation. subtitles. No. no. As children, yeah. I would, I would die for my own, and honestly, I'd take that. I wasn't in protective custody or something. Okay. Where are they at now? They're in Jackson at a foster care. Okay. We will do everything. We, we have. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Has, has, has he made threats to harm your kids? I didn't know what to say. I don't know what to say. I'm scared. I know you're scared. You need to tell us the truth. Okay. You were you were there, right? Is that a yes? Okay. Oh. And you saw him shoot Jeremy. Oh my God. 
right? <laughs> Tell you what, at this point, just nod your head for me. You saw him shoot Jeremy. Okay. <laughs> just admit to the crime. Just admit you to the crime. understand that this person, he's told you he's done it before, correct? He's told other people. Yeah. Do you know who it is? Hoth is struggling to answer. She could be truly afraid for the lives of her children, but it is also possible that she is using this excuse to avoid answering questions that might show no. that she was more directly involved in Baron's death. No way. Do you know what we're talking about? You think a uh, think suspect do. would do that? Do you want to write it down or just say the name? I don't, I don't, I don't know what to do. You think okay. she's lying? <laughs> Let's do this. Look, look at me so I can see you nod your head. My old shock. Okay. <laughs> okay. When you say somebody else was involved. There wasn't anybody else. Okay, okay. There wasn't anybody Okay, I was concerned you said somebody else. He has connections is what you're saying? I don't know. You just, you don't know. I don't know. Okay, but don't it was, know. but it was Jay Clark who shot Jeremy, correct? <laughs> Can you, can you say yes or nod your head for me? Okay. Um. <laughs> Ashley, you're on the right track. It was just you and him there? You and Jay? Yeah, and Jeremy. Okay. Where no, you're wrong. You were just driving. We were driving to go hang out at our friend's house, and he wasn't. He didn't answer back or something. Were you and Jeremy arguing? No, we were getting along great. No, I was killing him. We were getting along great. We were arguing. I already shot him. He was. Who was Jay? Obviously, you and I, from, from what you told us and what we've talked to other people, Jay was obsessed with you. Yeah. Everybody says he was. <laughs> yeah. And Stop. He no, he didn't. He wasn't. He wasn't, wasn't, wasn't. Come on. Into the picture. <laughs> I, I didn't can realize that I had talked to him about me and Jeremy. And I had talked about hurting Jeremy. I did talk about Right. Him. No, I... <laughs> I had no idea. Well, I, am... I had no idea. All I did and was talk about wanting to hurt him. That Jeremy was the one thing that was going to get your kids taken away forever. Yeah. And you'd probably talk to Jay about that. Yeah. He was buying his stuff. Yeah. You know, paying your rent. Paying your rent. And he helped me to get into the apartment. Right. I mean, he obviously was, was into you, and he wanted you for himself. <laughs> what was the one thing standing Jesus in Christ. Way? He was ready to bother himself. He was ready to, and I know it's impossible. That Hand over the wanted, woman. But he was, he won't, he was, he wanted to do better. Supportive he was, dad. He was trying. <laughs> yeah, he really, really Fucking wanted. stupid. <laughs> what, whose vehicle were you in? <laughs> was it Jay's vehicle? <laughs> yeah. Which one? Yeah. <laughs> It sounds like that TikTok filter of like the 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 verb like the 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 reverb or the like the guy that did like that really old TikTok like when COVID started where he was like I got cheese I got cheese like, <laughs> I don't know if anybody that's like a really random reference I don't know if anybody knows what I'm talking about <laughs> Pepper Jack cheese. <laughs> When you say you were driving, Jeez. no, I wasn't driving. You weren't driving, but you guys were driving. Can you tell me kind of where you thought you were? Um, <laughs> I really don't know. I'm glad some people picked it up. Mm, no way. Mm. If you take like Reed Road or Camden Road out toward Reed, there's like a fork. There's a curve where you go straight. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah. 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 Uh, to Jeff's. Uh, All right, Jeff's. Okay. Uh, okay, Jeff, no last answered. name. Got it. And then so we were going to go to my number to find his phone. Uh huh. Okay. <laughs> and then you so killed your ex husband. <laughs> he was like, so now what? Like, now what? Like, get her done. And I was like, get her done. Get her it's done? Just, it's just a phrase. It's just an expression. Okay. It's just, you know, like right. people say, get her done. Okay. <laughs> get her done? <laughs> so. He said, said, get her done. So and she was like, done. yep. And then he was like, pop. What? And then, and then he said skull emoji type seven, and I was like, no cap. And then he shot him. Were you guys still in the car? Yeah. Baron had been shot five times. One gunshot was different than the other. <laughs> Evidence suggests that Hoth was responsible for at least one of the shots. Yeah. I'm shocked. Where was she? Was Jeremy? Jeremy was in the back seat. I was in the front. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> yeah, I know some of those words. I bet the captions aren't even here. The captions like I, I don't know. I got nothing, man. <laughs> Jeremy, 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 Jeremy. <laughs> The captions actually gave up. Where did the captions go? They said, I'm not doing this. Literally, where did the captions go? Oh my god. She actually was just so un. Is he sitting behind you? He's sitting behind me. Yeah. Did he say anything? Jeremy? No, the cap, they yeah, they actually were just like, nope. Mm -mm. That statement doesn't ring true. Does if it you kill true? someone and their body is found, you're going to discuss it with the other person involved. Uh -huh. Either you're going to coordinate your stories or threaten them, but you're going to say something. If he didn't, then why is Hoth so Yeah, afraid? I would be like, oh, oh, uh, <laughs> oh, the, whoa. I didn't know I was no way. Ah, oh, body. Ah. Oh. I thought maybe he would just oh. He missed or something. I just kept saying, Jeremy, Jeremy. And Jeremy wasn't saying anything. He, he leaned over and. He said, get her done. He went, and that was it. Okay. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> he leaned over and then he said <laughs> He says so now what? Okay. And I said take me home I want you always to take me home Take me home <laughs> Cause he's, cause we're Meanwhile the Burger King recording is like So I fucking killed him <laughs> I shot that bastard. <laughs> now she's like, ah! I can't can say Jerry. He knows he's gone. On. He's done. <laughs> he just said, now what? I said, I just want to go back home. Somebody take me home. Please take me home. And he said, okay, I'll take you home. Okay. <laughs> he dropped me off at home. So Jeremy was still in the car at that point? Yeah, yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> so how does Jeremy yeah, oh, geez. I have no idea. Oh man. I have no idea. I went home. Oh man. No, I really was not. With this one. I oh was man. Not. I no, was not. Oh jeez. <laughs> I went home. I think they're gonna catch me, guys. I freaked out. Oh. I left my phone in the car. <laughs> so your phone was in the car still? Yeah, and I went to my sister. Sister, I'm on the door, on the window, and she went to answer it. 
I'm, I'm getting nothing. Oh, come and collect it. He said he was so sorry, and I just lost it. I hit the floor. So <laughs> 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 I just lost it. And he said, oh, I'm going to get out of here. I should probably go. Oh, my God. And I said, oh, my God. And I said, oh, my God. And I said, oh, my God. tell you what he'd done with Jeremy you know, at that point? She hit the floor, dude. He didn't tell me anything. I didn't know. I just didn't know. I just didn't. I didn't. I didn't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Can I explain what's happening? She's lying terribly. I don't know. I didn't see it. I, was, I didn't even see it. I was just on my phone and all of a sudden I just hear it. It's like, oh my god. No, no, no. It was all the way against the window. I was so scared. I was like, oh my god. What are you saying? Were you parked? Or was he no, driving? we were driving. So did you see how he reached back to show you? Just like that? <laughs> And just shot. <laughs> How many times was the first? <laughs> you said he asked him to. Yeah, he shot him once the first time, and then there was two more times, and then right after that one first. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. No, you're fucking I'm so not. I'm so sorry. We understand. <laughs> Oh, I can't believe you shot him. I can't believe you shot him. Yeah, I'm sure you can relate, police officer. I mean, I can't believe it. I shoot people for no reason all the time. I would not be scared yeah. in this situation. Oh, my God. What has Jay told you since then? Nothing. You guys had to discuss if the body was found. And... He, he hasn't said nothing. I told him about it. And he's, he hasn't said anything. He hasn't said anything. What? Jeremy was found on Sunday. Yeah. What day do you remember the thing? It was, it was February 8th. He had corn that day. You know, because we all think he had was, corn that day. I just thought maybe, like, so maybe, like, he, he was okay. Like, he, maybe he went to a hospital or something. It was February 8th you shot him? Yes. What just happened? What? Is she speaking a different language? What am I hearing? He had corn and... He did show up at court. He showed up that day. It was the last day of court. He was so ready to take his lie detector tester for me to do it. All of the sobbing is distracting from the fact that Hoth really isn't giving him any new information. She insists that she hasn't discussed the discovery of Baron's body with Clark, but the detectives are highly skeptical. She did at Burger King, though. <laughs> oh, God. So you're saying it happened on February 8th? Yeah. So... And I remember being at Burger King and being like, so I didn't kill him. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, he wasn't found until eight. I know. I just didn't know what to do. I was so scared. Okay. This guy is. Oh my god, he just does that. It was just like denies the that. guilt. Well, like denies. Okay. Denies being involved like completely coherently. I'm not saying you're not telling the truth, but <laughs> the coroner says he was only dead three or five. I'm not I saying you're that. lying. I don't get it. I don't understand, but, but no. But you're lying. You're positive it was that day that he died. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah. He was not three to five days. You're saying he was missing since? He's been missing since. Or that it happened it did. Okay. It's the worst day of my life. I wouldn't forget it. <laughs> um, has Jay told you he's done it before? <laughs> She yeah, sounds like yeah. Seth Rogen. Did he tell you the circumstances of that one? And then I killed him. <laughs> That's so stupid. No, no. Do you believe him? <laughs> yeah, I believe him. Are you crazy? Oh my god. Oh my he god. Who just does that? I just I don't, don't understand. Somebody that needs to be put away. I just don't understand. 
I think you do, unfortunately. Miss no, I shot I've never told you anything about the other person who killed him, just that he had. Wow, it's been 30 minutes. That's it. Yeah, you were with Jay this weekend? Yeah. Okay. Over with you want to because I didn't fucking go. Okay. I believe you. How was he this weekend? I believe you. He's always cool calling the What did you say about what happened? He doesn't. He doesn't. I don't want to. I didn't want to. You didn't want to ask, so you I never brought it up. No. Okay. He said, when he came back with my phone, he said, I said, where is he? Why does she was. turn into a... Your phone was in the car. I didn't have a lot of gas, so I just brought it back to you. He said, he just really had a plan. He didn't know what to do. He didn't know. Why does she turn into a mumble rapper? Oh, what are you doing? <laughs> he said, he just thought we'd go. I was losing it. Do you know what happened to the Tahoe? Does he still have it? He don't. Um, <laughs> Leslie... <laughs> Yeah, I'm really worried about it. I don't know She's why. She's really making sure that they know her Seth Rogen's on point, but. He got rid of it. I, he told me he gave it to his daughter, so I was like, he, he did it. Okay. He the second she's asked to give details, she be, she just starts oh. mumble rapping. So he didn't destroy it or burn it or what about the back seat? Maybe the cry is like her you signature, you know, how like there's like a thing at the beginning when you're the producer. <laughs> Maybe what she's the producer, and she's like, Aah. I don't know. How do you know he did? Or like Chance the Rapper when he's like, ah! You know what I mean? Maybe that's hers. Yeah, her producer tag. No, no. Was that because there was blood in the backseat? I imagine so. He didn't tell you. I love my wife. I love my wife. Ah! Yeah. There's he's a god. There's a Oh my god. Oh my god. This is this is really out of nowhere and it has to do with the bit. But has anybody seen um has anybody seen that TikTok of like if country music had producer tags? <laughs> it's like, wow, well, goddamn Cletus, you sure fucked him up with this one. <laughs> I fucking love that video. It's so funny. <laughs> I wish they had him. It's just, it, it's, I don't know. It would be really good. That would, I would lose it. I would lose it every time. So when did he show up with the Mustang? Um. You got stopped up in Jonesville. Yeah, with it. it was like that day or like a couple of days before that. That he got that car? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> kind of going back to that day. I just, I just, oh my God. I just, I mean, I just, I was like, Jeremy, did you find your phone? No, I just, I just, I just didn't. I don't want it to be real. Did you send, you sent Jeremy's phone text? Yeah. What did they say? It says, did you find your phone, Jeremy? Jeremy, I said, Jeremy. Jeremy. <laughs> Apparently, Clutch didn't do a very good job of cleaning the vehicle. In fact, if they How do you even hear planning, anything? They wouldn't have shot him in the Tahoe at all. At least, not without something covering the seats. How do you have any services. details to go off of? She's just oh, mumbling. I can't hear a single word. Have you and Jay had any conversations over text or anything? <laughs> 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 what do you think Jay's gonna say if we talk to him? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I think he'll say <laughs> I did it. <laughs> no, no, no. Jeremy took that gun. How do you know Jay didn't get it? Jeremy told me and Leslie he took it. Leslie and Jeremy went to my house to try to take it because he thought I was gonna hurt myself. <laughs> and and uh, so they far couldn't far. get in and I guess Jeremy, after Leslie went away, like Jeremy came back and took it. And later when me and Leslie and him were hanging out, like he told her that he did come back and take the gun. And Good God. she was 
And you know, like, what the fuck do you? We come, like, it was a joke. She right. was like, you come and do a job together, and then you do come back and do it without me. It was like, I was a dude. You know, they were trying to break it and take it. Be, 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 be. And the bullets and it wasn't that. It wasn't. You took the gun and was. the bullets and it wasn't that. Was. And this is very important, okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I could. Told. Yeah, I, yeah, she's totally painting a picture right now. Nobody. Man. That conversation I had with my sister was the most intense. Leslie, no. No, God, no, she don't know. I don't know. I wanted to tell her like what do I do? I didn't know. I didn't know. It ain't any funny. <laughs> and then I just didn't know. I 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 didn't know. What is this? What is she doing with every part of her body? And what we wasn't, we haven't talked about when he was coming back over. Is he supposed to pick you up from work? No. I know. No. <laughs> I guess this is important too. Where does he live? You know where he lives. He lives by the Dum Dum Factory and Brian with his brother. With his brother? Yeah. Is it a house? It's a house. Okay. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Dumb What's Factory. Uh, Chris. Who's his last name, Clark? I don't know. I, I think, I imagine so. That's the brother. He has another brother, but they, he don't live there. Is it brother's house? It's brother's it's house. It's his brother's house. Yeah. And it's in Brown. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> Is that where you stayed this weekend? No, I didn't stay there. I was at home. You stayed at home? Yeah, it was. Well, last night I was at home, and then the day before that. I didn't stay down there. We, we went down there all day and worked on my car. Got to the apartment with him. Yeah, right. we went and worked on my car. And then we, oh wait, no, we, I, yeah, we did stay there all night. We stayed at his brother's house one night. Okay. And then he Sorry, there too. did you mean to do that? Who? That was me. Jay, with his brother? Yes, okay. yeah. Uh, but his brother's, in, he's out of, he's out of state right now. Uh, do his all, I don't know. Uh, so he's, his brother's not there. His brother have anything to do with this? No. I don't think anybody does. I mean, where is the way we even was? Did you see what Jay did with the gun after this happened? No. You didn't see him throw it out? No. Okay. No, he, had, he still had it with him. Because I, I, I was so scared. And I was like, just grabbing it. I don't know what he's going to do. And he's like, slowly grabbing the whole thing. Was he sitting? I'm going to sit by his legs because I reached for it. So what did <laughs> it look like? It was just black. Was it, uh, describe it to us? I don't know. It was dark. It was a dark. Because <laughs> you described the one to us you had. Yeah, it was, it was like this. Did it have the cylinder? Like I don't know. I don't know. Like this big, you saying? How, how big did you? Uh, like, I don't know. I'm not positive. Black. I was just freaking out. Did you say it was black? <laughs> yeah. There was like, I had like a tear or something in the front seat with me. It was like this flash over because I was, like, freaked out. I was like. Did you think he had shot at you? <laughs> I thought his tear was blood was all over me or something. Like I didn't know what was going on. <laughs> Did you have any blood on you? No. 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 Where, where are the clothes you wore? Like? And my own. You could show us? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bro, why is she yeah. like moving it's hard to so believe much that in the confines of the car and with baron being shot five times hoth didn't have any blood on her at the very least as distraught as she claims to have been she would have reached out and touched him perhaps checking to see if he had survived and could be saved most likely she is trying to distance herself from any direct involvement no way i warned him i watched him okay I don't know. Do you recall what Jay was wearing that night? <laughs> no. You think an accomplice to murder would lie? Yeah. I can't remember what shirt he was wearing. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he had a green guard heart. I don't know. <laughs> Some jeans. Some jeans. Did the coat say anything on it? Or? Carhartt. Carhartt. <laughs> 
Um, oh, my God. I'm going to have somebody sit with her. <laughs> Give us just a sec, Ashley. We're going to have someone sit with you, and we'll be ready to go, okay? Oh, boy. Was she just going to stop doing it? <laughs> I'm getting a headache. I'm getting a headache hearing this fucking like moaning Myrtle shit. <laughs> fucking Kyle over here is like, oh well, shit. <laughs> I hate my fucking job. Sign up for the force and they make you sit with the weird ones. Does it work if I just flip it open? Yeah. That's boomer. Is it dead or? <laughs> just don't delete anything. Yeah, just don't delete anything because then we're going to have to get a subpoena or a warrant. That would be tough. You'd make us do our job. Good lord, dude. Just don't delete anything. Don't delete anything. That from? It's from the don't make us have okay. to get a warrant to search your deleted well. data. I would sure hate to put in more effort into my job. Okay, we just want to make sure he wasn't texting us. No. Hold on. Is that from him? No, just, that was, just actually yeah, is texting her. <laughs> so I remember when I killed him. <laughs> so you're asking him to, to get fucked up because you can't deal with this sober? Are you referring to what happened? Can do yeah anything. <laughs> I guess at this point, um, we'd like to go for a ride, so you can show us where you think you were when it occurred. Would you be willing to do that? I really don't know where I was. I will, I will be willing to, but I don't. I really have no idea. Oh um, my! You said you were headed to Montgomery, right? Yeah, yeah I think we were on like Wilson Road or something out there, but we had like. Turned. I was trying to give me to scratch the ass. I don't know. I'm Sketch your book. Uh, Come here. Like, here. Not like Wilson thing? Lake Pleasant or. No, no, what is that road? Oh, we're just right outside off of Bacon. Off of Bacon? It's like the lake road, but like, that's not the way we Which went. Which way? Because we were going Are you going like towards reading or away? Because Lake Pleasant is on the other side yeah. of the house, too. What's the one down this way? Lake, lake Wilson Road. Wilson. Is it? Okay, then Lake Wilson Road. Okay. But <laughs> we, didn't, we didn't even get to reading. Like, we went to, we were going to go to Jeff's house and he didn't answer. So we just kept going. I don't know what road he lives on. I can show you. What road Jeff lives on? You yeah, can I can okay. show you. I just don't we're know. not interested. Am I in any trouble? Am I, are you, or what do I do? Am I in like, trouble? Do I just go home? Like, I don't know what I do. What do I do? You're like, not going home, lady. Well, obviously, right now, what we're looking into, you know. <laughs> I mean, we had the information. Yeah. So we, we, we yeah. talked to you, obviously. And we're to this point. Yeah. Okay. We need to fill in. We need to fill in some light. You admitted to helping with a though. murder on a, like on a recording. Like, you know, like, how far you this got is from your Jeff's home. Or how long it was from Jeff's to... It was just a few minutes. You are home. So, you, if we're at Jeff's in <laughs> a few minutes, we... I don't know. I really don't know. I know we live at this place, I think. And... How far does Jeff live from your house? Um, like five minutes. Okay. So not very far. No. What is Jeff's last name? I don't know. Yeah. I don't know his last name. Mom. You could point his house out to us, though. Yeah. Do you know Sorry, wrong Jay. Wrong Jay. I think we just went past it, like I said. We went, because he lives on the curb. Why don't we take a ride? Let's take a ride. Guys, maybe it'll help you. No, I, I really don't know. I, I, I didn't, I didn't, it wasn't looking at where we were. Like, I was. Hope claims that she won't be able to find her way to the scene of the crime. She hadn't been driving all the time and hadn't really been paying attention. This much, at least, might have been true if she was leaving things up to Clark. Freaking out. <laughs> At least you can show us Jeff's and you know you went there. Yeah. And nobody was home or he didn't. We didn't even go there because he didn't answer his phone. So you just drove by? Yeah. Okay. But mm. then a few minutes after that is when. Yeah. Did you guys, the three of you, go anywhere else that night? No, it was the first day they ever met. Okay. <laughs> that was the first day they met? Yeah. Where did, where did Jay pick you up? 
only one of them to pick us. Me, he picked me and Jeremy. Like, they were there together before I got home from my visit. Like, he just got there a few minutes. And they were building cars and drinking beer. And he picked us up from there. Okay, so Jeremy was with Jay when you got home? Yeah. Okay, and you were at a visit? Yeah. Okay. Did you guys stop at any stores? No, no. Nothing? Nothing. What time was it? Uh, it was about, I, he, I got home about 8 o'clock from my visit. I would say probably about 9. I got back at like 10.30 in my place. Because I, I remember looking at the clock. And I, was, I cannot I imagine being the police officer's in this situation. I would tell this well, person to shut the fuck up. Well, you were up banging on so quick. Yeah, and then I went back to sleep. And I woke up at 9 o'clock and I was like, what the fuck is going on? Oh, yeah, yeah. I had dropped <laughs> dirty. Well, you were there, man. I'm <laughs> guessing that might be yeah, slang she wherever she's yeah, at. Yeah, she, she didn't answer. And the next day, like, like, I went over there, but I couldn't say anything. I just cried. I just hungry. And I just told her that I was just upset about the kids. <laughs> well, I understand you're saying you don't know exactly, but if we can take a ride to point out with Jess, and at yeah. least we have an idea where Jeff's is, and... Uh, a couple of minutes, and there is where it occurred. Yeah. You wouldn't take the great car. Yeah. yeah. You'd rather not ride the police car, right? I assume. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Take, your water. Yeah. Yeah, take your water. Do you want to take some tissue? Uh, yeah. Yeah, go ahead. Here. Matter of fact, I think there's some in the car. Okay. Does she have the Burger King uniform on right now? Did she get picked up mid shift? She got the Burger King drip on. For how long can you fake cry like that? That sounds like, it seems exhausting. So again, we have a few more questions. Okay. Um, we discussed some more stuff in the car there. Um, you had mentioned at some point you may have said he just needed to fucking die. Not saying you meant it. Yeah, but, but and I said it, but you know. She's a hundred percent got the Burger King uniform on. Look at that. You can literally see like the tomato and and burger and the bun. He was wow. mean. You know, I probably said that to a lot of people. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, everybody just you, don't you think know. About yeah, that. you don't. Think everybody. So. Like, did he, did Jay say anything like, like, that, like, you, like he Fuyu Hiko that from Danganronpa, being like or? being like, I'll oh, fucking tell you. And no, but the way he acted in the car, like after each other, like I, I was completely convinced that because he said, this is what you wanted, right? And I was like, no, no, no. Yeah, everybody talks like that, yeah. Now you can get your kid back. Like, you totally, you bro. Yelling, you think you you know, yelling at you? Kind of, he was in a raised voice. Okay. <laughs> Can you remember? Can you may have said that around him. No, close to that time. Or no, no I don't remember? know. Cause I think it was like around the time when I first met him when we first talked about Jeremy. We, he didn't like talking about Jeremy, like because I would quote some, of it. you know, Jeremy talking. I would always talk about Jeremy. He, he didn't like it. You know, oh, you would I, talk about your ex in front of your boyfriend. I wonder why he'd be upset about that. <laughs> what would he say? When he got upset about you would you. talk about your ex in front of your he new boyfriend. That. I needed to let that shit go. That that guy is not always right. Yeah, yeah I was. Wonder know, why he would be upset by that. Something in me <laughs> about him. He didn't say much. How are the interrogators not laughing right now? Because they're police. Their lives are boring. So they decided to be the the most like non-earning automatic privilege job ever. So they can just like do nothing enjoyable with their life. They clearly there there's a disconnect there, you know. When he you said he came back to bring your phone back. Yeah. He told you he did something with him. You said. Yeah, he, he said. He you said because you said you asked where yeah, he was. He said he just dumped him somewhere. He didn't know where he was. 
So you think that he was not in the car when he came back? Right. Yeah. Why are they both so leaning against the off, wall? In the car. Yeah. Because they're tough, bro. Evidence will later emerge that Hoth deliberately manipulated Clark into killing or helping to kill Baron. As for Clark dropping her off at home and then going to dispose no of the way. body by himself, it's highly improbable. No at way. At the very least, it would be dangerous and foolish. Riding around with a bullet riddled body in broad daylight only increases your chances of getting caught. Wait, why? Yeah. And hadn't said anything. <laughs> he didn't say anything. <laughs> Wait, really? <laughs> I just like, and I touched his way and was like, Jeremy. Jeremy. He didn't move or something? No. He didn't move. Like, I don't know if it was just because we were driving. <laughs> These words aren't in the Bible. Not of them. He's not in funny. How was Jeremy in the back seat after he got shot? How mean? How was he? Like, was he laying down? Was he? I think he was dead. He, he was like leaned up against the window. Wild guess here. If you were sitting, if that's the seat, kind of, and that's the window. Show I'm not right. sure, but I think it was like this. Did he ever move Jeremy at all? No. That you saw? Like... No, he was driving. Okay. He was driving. So he never stopped to like put him no. on the floor? No, no, he just kept driving. He didn't even, he didn't even, he just, he just shot him. No, he, he didn't just going. shoot him. He said, get her done. And you said, yeah. Don't forget that part. That's important. When he shot him to when he got you back home. We, I, I, I don't know. We, we weren't very far. We could have, we hadn't been on that road. That, with the way we came to Jess, we had to have been right on that road when it happened. Okay. Yeah, had to have been. You think some like professional, like prosecuting lawyer, will like quote what she said about him saying "get her done"? You think like they'll include that in the courtroom? I really hope they did. I think we came back. He took me back home the way we initially went there. He took me right back. To and you're stated as quote home. saying, "Get her done." <laughs> what did you mean by yeah, that? What did you think home. he meant by that? I just want to go home. Okay, that's what you want. I'll take you. Because I'm not gonna hurt you. <laughs> Is that okay? <laughs> did you ask him if he was going to No. I think he thought I did. And I had a gun in my own. And I, like, was reaching for it. And he just got it and put it in his lap. And I told him, I was like, I was, you know, I was, I wasn't going to. And he was just okay. Yeah, it's like, all right, guys. Guys, I understand the laugh is, or the, the cry is weird. It's, you know, n not a lot of people know this, but Seth Rogen ghost wrote this interview. <laughs> Because you don't got to be scared of me because I was like <laughs> way out to the door, like way back here. <laughs> <laughs> when I was in the car, I was kind of looking at your steps. <laughs> and there's one in there where you tell him that it's Jeremy. He's telling you how sorry he is. Literally 50% of it what do you sounds, think like sounds like she's laughing. Sounds like she's like, I don't know. <laughs> Tell me he'll be there for you. Yeah. I don't How did that make you I, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Are you just me? <sighs> I don't know. I don't know. She's really hitting the Dane Cook fake cry. How can you be there for someone? <laughs> Who's over the person you told <laughs> It's a little fucked up. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> That's why I'm asking because I'm re you know, I was looking at your text and it's like. That's yeah, a little unbelievable, you could say. 
and we kind of touched on it, and you kind of seemed like you didn't want to. I'm just being a real ham on me right now. This other person, or this other time he's talked about killing someone. What Not he, someone. People. Or, uh, what did he tell you about them? Just that he had taken many, people, many kids away from their parents and many fathers away from their families. <laughs> and that this is not who he is. You know, this is not who he is. This is somebody he used to be. He's trying to forgive himself. And God's forgiven him. He can't forgive himself. This is that this, he's never, I guess, I don't know, because he kind of like tears in his eyes and it's never been some personal before. <sighs> if this is true, it sounds like Clark may be connected to multiple unsolved murders or no missing person way. cases. The detectives are definitely interested. Are you saying like when he said and out, his out loud that he's gotten away with murder time. multiple times, Prior you think that means case. he actually has gotten away with murder multiple times? What or do you think he like that? made that up? I don't know. Um, Was it that night? No, no. No, no. no. Can't believe he's just um, like just not recently. lying about just that. Recently. That's crazy. So you guys were discussing what had happened then? No, he was just making sure I was okay, I guess. I don't know. Like, he was just expressing to me how much he liked me and that he's oh never been able goodness. to be honest about who he was with anybody. And, and just how bad him. You think this guy who's killed was. somebody has killed more than oh, one right. somebody? That's. I'm just trying to stay calm and, and just be his friend, you know? Sorry. He would. He had discussed something with somebody. Like they freak out, and then you remember exact words, but basically, then he had to. I don't know. He had to what? I don't know. I don't know where he remembers exact words, but the whoever who who freak out. And, Basically, I don't know. I got to basically I take care of them because he had told them and they so were. Basically, that's kind of a indirect threat to you. And if you, that's how I, I take care of those right, people. That's what I thought. Sorry for the he windows, Lord. He's speaking my phone back that night. He was like, well, all I do is you know, he left. And, you know, he was still upset and, and, you'll be, and, you'll, and you'll be okay. So he told you what to say? Did he tell you to go around looking for him? No. No. Did he tell what you to cry you like that? At first, like, I was seriously just like, it's just, I didn't know, I didn't, I just didn't really think it was real. Like, I thought maybe he went to a hospital, like, someone seen him. I, mean, I don't know. And then I was just scared. And then I was just scared, and then Chad said he had seen him. And I was like, where is he? Like, where is he? Take me to him. Where is he? <laughs> So you were kind of hoping he was still alive? Yeah. Yeah. It just didn't seem real. I just didn't. The guy shot him. I just, I just don't understand. I just don't understand. I just don't understand how someone could just do that. Just to do that. To be honest with you, it's a person that doesn't need to be walking the sidewalks yeah. no. with anybody's children or anybody. It's a person. And I didn't know. I didn't know what he would do to me. You know, or, or, I'm pretty confident I know what he yeah, was doing. Yeah, I think you were talking to us. And so I think that's why, you know, I, I so continue to look for Gary. And they, they said he'd see him. Like, where is he then? Like, it, <laughs> so you mentioned that you said at, at some time you may have said something along the lines that he just needs to fucking die. Yeah, I said and, with a lot of people. So who else did you tell them? I don't know. Everybody, Jeremy knows. Everybody knows the situation. Yeah, you, you know, like everybody knows. And it was no secret. Jeremy knew exactly how I felt about it. It was no secret. I, how he you knew that you wanted him to die? No, he knew that I definitely felt like I could not leave for two weeks when I first met him, that I was held there. He was insane, he feared for my life many times. I had run off many times. Just Yeah, even he knew that there. I wanted to kill him. I it was just a thing we did. Everybody it was just a bit, you know. Just some, it was some classic <laughs> Ashley and Jeremy shenanigans. Andy's, he wouldn't stay away, and, uh, and I went over to Elby's and with an umbrella or whatever, and hit him with that. 
please stay away from me. Don't lose her, no. Just go. You gotta stay with me. I'm telling you, I'll be your witness. Like, do not come around me. <laughs> so you told your sister. You told Billy. Did you tell anybody else? No, I don't remember. Albie. No, Albie came over and he, he said he, he was like, stop looking for something you're never going to find. And I said, what are you talking about? He says, what are you, you talking about, dude? He said that he left with Ken, Ken Amazinger. And so what was that story? I don't know. That's why I didn't. I really didn't know. Like maybe you know, he's Jimmy is like a Yeah, maybe he's. You know, he did. Me. I didn't know. I didn't know. Is there any discussion again? I think I asked you that with you and Jay about where no. he was. He didn't. Jay didn't know. He said he didn't know where he was. So he just dumped him somewhere. Yeah, he didn't know where he was. <sighs> Does he know the area very well? No. No. He didn't say how he got to where he was at or... I always like these ones because there's nothing much for me to commentate or to show what they're doing. They're just really letting this person talk and they already know everything. So she's just saying like just the most ridiculous bag of bullshit you could ever hear. So like I feel bad not talking, but also like I can't really be like, well, the police are saying this to do this. Meanwhile, she's just saying... Everything so, to like, bury herself in this situation door, more. And then I went around to her window. Like, what do I say? And point? I got in her window for a while. And she said she woke up and she thought uh. it was her ex-boyfriend. So she didn't answer you. You should have said it. You know, it's Ashley or something. And so I, I, I just went home. <laughs> you know what I mean? And shortly after, I don't know how long. What do I even yeah, do? I about an hour. I think for, yeah, about an hour. Not too long, though. No. Not like halfway through the next day. No, 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 no. I, I would say before midnight. And what time did you get back and look at the clock? At 10.30, I, ten thir I think it was 10.35. It was, I walked over to my sister's. Okay. And you're positive this was what day? February 8th. It was the, the Wednesday before the week of Valentine's Day, because I had a visit. And that's the day, the first that's time we talked to you, you said that's the last time you saw Yeah, mm -hmm. and then that's, he had court that morning at like 10.30 or something. Okay. Mm. Based on Hoth's statement alone, Clark's defense team has their work cut out for them. It sounds like he is an experienced killer and has threatened the life of a no, single mother. No, he doesn't. He is obsessed with. With his setup, Hoth stands a good chance of getting out of this completely. No, she doesn't. She admitted to it on Can a recording. Okay meeting this guy? Yeah. Yeah. I told him, you know, this, about him, you know, and you know. And... Uh, they're just going to use both of them against okay each other and then put both of them in jail. They, yeah, I thought he was an okay guy. And eventually, like, they did, like, I think Jay blocked him because he was disrespecting me or something. He wasn't going to talk to him no more. And I told Jeremy, I was like, Jay wants to come over and drink that cool with you. And he said, yeah, I'm going to come over. And I told Jay, I said, well, Jeremy's here. You want to come over? I'm like, this, it, this time... You know, be bad. And uh, he, he was there before. He, he he was there when I was on my back. And he said, uh, "I'm here. Uh, should I go, go in? I think or something." He said, "Should I introduce myself?" And I said, "Yeah, go ahead. Go. You know." Okay. So Jeremy was at your place. Yeah. Okay. Yep. And I came back, and they were drinking beer. We we drank beer. We played cards. And we, did they seem to be getting along? Yeah, they were getting along real good. Yeah, I can tell. They were getting along We were having a good time. And there was no argument in the car? No. Like Jeremy didn't say something rude to you? No, no, no. You just turned around and have you said get her done? Yeah. Sorry, I forgot to go. Did Jay ever said anything like, no, take care of your problem for you? No, or? he would he would say because when I talk about him and he didn't because he said he don't like the way he disrespected me, and uh, he said I swear the first time I see him he said I'm gonna fuck him up. Sounds like he's done that with other people. Yeah, sounds like it's happened before. No way. Like he doesn't fear. They're baiting her. People. They're asking her to answer that question. <laughs> he just didn't. They're suggesting she answers that question to convict him of multiple things. Just a thing. Okay. 
one of the things I was looking through my notes, um, somebody had said that, because apparently there was a call on it around March, after you had a fire, right? Yeah. The day that... No, I had this fire after... Right, 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 okay, right, right, right. right. Okay, But sorry. it was sometime after that... Why did you delete the, that? The, uh, That's not a link. Uh, maintenance guy came up to your apartment, mm -hmm. and there was a couple guys there. And I think she... I think it's yeah, no, supposed to be. No, no, it was Billy, and I think it was Jamar. I think no. Twitch chat no, no, is no, just Dirk. dumb and thinks Dirk. that's a link, so it hyperlinks yeah, it, but okay. it's not actually. What does Jamar look like? Oh, he's a, he's a black man, um, kind of heavy, heavier. Okay. They were just they were they were checking on me. Okay. Do you kind of remember that? Just... Checking on me. Yeah, because the main thing was there, and they were they were all there, and Billy was telling um telling me to tell the maintenance guy that if he didn't have time to come back, you know, he could do that and fix the drywall or a recent contract or whatever else. Mm -hmm. Okay. I think the maintenance guy said something about they were playing checkers or cards or something. No, there's a there is a checkers. My son has a round checker table. It like mm -hmm. painted on checkers, and that was in the living room. They probably had cards on it. Like, I expect to drink them really heavily after this. So yeah. Wow, great! Day, oh, oh, there goes the boy. child endangerment. So, I, just, so, I was drinking heavily in front of my <laughs> child. I can't even imagine. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like. Oh, go ahead. Oh man, I'm just so sorry. Something I had, I had no sad. Made this guy do this to this man. Well, what do you think he said? I don't know. Just, just in general, about the way he treated me. <laughs> like if, uh, if this guy wouldn't been around here, he would still be here. Like, like what? <laughs> Again, did you have any specific conversation with him? No. He was like, I'll take care of your problems if you want me to. He did, yeah, he he said that, but I didn't think he meant like anything like that. What did he say to you? Like, like I said, he would, he would say, first time I see him, I'm going to talk him up. He said, he said, I don't know how I would be able to handle him talking to you like that if I was around. <laughs> but again, you weren't arguing that night? No, he didn't me. I mean, he didn't say it, call your name. No, he just no, turned. get it great. While it does sometimes happen that someone will take it into their head to defend another person after hearing how they've been treated, it's unusual for them to proceed to hang out with the person they dislike and then act violently without provocation. Like, just, Leslie dropped us off like the day before. <laughs> we were getting along great. We had every step back from court. Loud. Oh. <laughs> it's so loud. 
Oh. Nice, bro. Gonna save this really quick. And that was sus. Why is my life painful? Oh. All right, I'm back. Yeah, but he met him through me. Like, does he talk to Jeff on the phone? No. No. No, they, you know, uh, more, like, more, like, care for each other. Does he talk to your sister? No. Does he, he talk to anybody else? He had met my sister. Okay. No, he, he doesn't talk to sister. anybody. He was going to fix her. Actually, talks to nobody. Song. Does he know anybody else at Burger King? Mm. What, what even at Burger King? Where he could story. call somebody and say, hey, the cops came and got her again. A Burger Queen, maybe? No. Nope. And I think you would kind of talk about this. Uh, about, would you be willing to contact him? Yeah, no. but like. Oh, okay, yeah. If you told him like I'm having a, a terrible time, I just want to spend some more time with you. Yeah. If you said, I'm yeah. Up here, yeah. Having a hard time. I know time, you're saying I, I don't you. know if he will or not. Like, I know it's going to his sister Samantha, and I'm not sure how he's going. He's going to be there today. I don't know if he'll come back up because I know he said he didn't have a lot of money because of. Him overdrawn his account for, um. So I don't, I don't know. We like, don't wanna... or this weekend, like he, he had said it probably wouldn't be until the next weekend until he had, would come up. Okay. So would it be odd if he did that, or you think he maybe, might? probably because like we didn't discuss it, him going bad. Like he would have usually would have asked, asked to hang out. Like he works in the morning, I work. Mm -hmm. Um, we had just spent the weekend together. He had already said it would probably be out next weekend. But he did say, uh, unless he wanted to be sooner. So it's possible he would come up. But like, well, do you think contacting him would make him think what the fuck's up? Or if you're like, hey, I need, yeah, I, I need. I mean, you already talked to him. Yeah. Like I'm having a rough yeah, time. Yeah, I'm having a rough I'm time. Yeah. Up or whatever. No, I'm like probably like, just, you know, does what are you doing? Know you don't work tomorrow. Do you work tomorrow? I work every day, oh. every single day. So, and so does he. Yeah, he works Monday through Thursday, six to five, and then on Fridays he works six to twelve. Okay. Would you be open to having a conversation with him? Probably text. About what? Though? Just no. like it would be, he like he wouldn't talk. He no, 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 no. Yeah, we're, I don't think coming up. Just coming up. Yeah. Okay. Or would he call you? Want to talk to you? No. So it's always text. Usually, I like I called him the day like I said you didn't show well, up. Plus, for... he thinks you're working because you could say, "Hey, I'm yeah. working right now," but yeah. Hopefully, I'm getting yeah. Okay. I mean. I think it would be weird if I was trying to have him come back up here today, but I could ask him, like, you know, well, what are you doing after you're done at your sister's or, or whatever, and see if he wanted to hang out then if he didn't have okay. You know what I mean? But Maybe just kind of say, hey, what are you doing? You know, I'm having a rough not time. Not to say, but if you, would you want to hang out or something later? Or right, available? yeah. But he knows you ain't got wheels, right? Yeah. Yeah, we were, we were at, uh, he has my car at his garage or whatever and we were working on a car like, so obviously if he if you guys were to get together it would, it would be him coming up yeah because you don't have a ride yeah it's always been okay but he was going to sisters you know that. after church yeah and i don't know where she was I, he said her, her, her name is samantha he has a daughter named sam too um yes he was doing i imagine he was going to be there most of the rest of the day okay. Because obviously, you know, as we've all discussed, is this is someone that doesn't need to be out running around. And that's obviously safer for you if we can get this guy picked up. Safer for everybody. Yeah. Especially you. Yeah. I mean, I just don't understand. It sounds like the police want to set up some kind of a sting, possibly to get him to talk about the shooting. With no way. Him. They have enough information to bring him in for questioning, but Hoth? appears willing to take the risk. I'm just so kidding. <laughs> I mean, he didn't even know me. Like, he just, we just, just recently just knew each other. Oh. Do you feel like anything you ever did kind of let him on where no. he thought he had a chance no, with you? No, I told him that. I said, like, you know, I'm not looking for any kind of relationship for a very, very long time. I said, uh, so if there's any kind of intention for this to go anywhere else, I said, I'm not trying to lead you on, like, you don't have, we, then we probably shouldn't hang out. I said, you're cool, just be friends, and that's all that will ever be. So then that's fine with me, because he never, even, he never, like, flirted, he never, he never made a pass. He was completely respectful the saying? entire time, the entire time. Like, mm. he was, he, 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 you think this was something he did to show 
you that he was, I mean... I don't know. I don't know. What did you say? You I think he, like, he leaned, like, <laughs> it is, I just don't understand where he, like, I just don't think a person would go there. Like, and he knows that I do want him on my life, that I need him on my life, and I was still seeing him. You know what? This goes in to shoot with somebody. I mean, for a while, like, he didn't, he didn't even know me. Who am I? No. I only knew him since November. No, well, remember. If you want to re renew or um, refund no. the automaton no. attempt, I, I'm obviously busy right now. I'm so scared. Like, this guy seriously thought that he thought that's what I wanted. And when he seen my, my face and I freaked out, like, I thought he was going to do me in too, because what are you, why are you going to leave the person there? Well, that would be one of our thoughts. Right. Did you tell him you talked to us the first time? Mm -hmm. What did he say? Okay. He didn't ask you any questions. I told him. He said I okay, said. yeah, I bet. He said okay. And you told us what he told you to say? Huh? Real. Or what, that you hadn't seen He him? said, all right, whatever. Yeah, I, just, I told him what, what I had said. And he didn't question you anymore? And... No. All, okay. all good, LOL. You know Kenny Nolan? Yes. I know Kenny. Uh, Kenny is what, is married to Mandy Barron, which is Jeremy's cousin. You think of Kenny Nelson? Oh, Kenny Nelson. Kenny Nolan. Down at George Weir's down there on Austin Road. The way they looked at each other. Mm -hmm. The cops were like, you oh. Mm -hmm. What? When was the last time you talked to him? Um, I don't know. Do you ever talk to, about, to Kenny about wanting a gun? Yeah, because I, but I was trying to, it was somebody else trying to find their gun that Jeremy had took. <laughs> okay. And he, I, like, thought that he just sold it to him, so I was, okay. and it was the gun that Jeremy had gotten me, and I, I thought it was a really cool gun. Fuck that with that gun bag and he took it for me because he thought I was gonna shoot myself and he's like, You can't even I can't even trust you with this. No gun, da 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 da. So you thought maybe Jeremy had given it to Kenny? Yeah. And you were trying to buy it back or something? Yeah, because I guess apparently who who's it, the person was looking for it, like it was some sentimental value or whatever. Okay. And then Jeremy just took it. Okay. When did the backseat come out missing in that towel? I don't know. The next time I've seen it, there was no seat. When did you next see him after that? I'm not sure. Um, I'm not sure. But you asked him about it? No. Or, no. It just, I mean, clearly was gone. But you said he told you you got rid of it and burned it. Yeah. Uh, I think he, I think he said that. Um. There was a bullet, hole or something. Shit. In the <laughs> And then what did you say about getting rid of it? Yeah, so he burned it. He told you that? That he burned it? He, okay. Are you sure? That's what he told me, yes. He said he burned it. Is there anything else about it? Seems that? likely. It seemed like you no, were no, he said he thinking it. about something there. No. So you have had discussion about what occurred? Yeah. This way, I, I asked him, like, maybe, you know, <laughs> Okay, and he got to a hospital or something like, and he just kind of, kind of just let the chuckle or laugh or whatever. He said no. What did she just say? We were talking to the the other the lieutenant, and they were he got a hold of the coroner. Yeah. Um, they feel very strongly that there's an, uh, another bullet hole. They another think you hole. lied. That there might have been another shot from a smaller gun. So, I don't hear four shots. Okay. And, and, like, and the reason I asked, just if he made you shoot him no, afterwards no, or no, anything no, like that? No, no, no. No, I like shot that. him willingly. <laughs> oh. Both has missed a golden opportunity to claim that Clark forced her to shoot Baron against her will. Yeah, she really it did. Have explained any forensic evidence leaking her to a gun or blood, and yep. at the very least would have helped her to get a reduced sentence. Eventually. Nope. We just want it all out on the table that way. Can't argue that, no. Yeah, and no, I only I heard four shots, and he didn't make me do anything. No, I I, I, I shot, shot him willingly. Yeah. Me. 
No, I didn't see any other guns. Um, Oops. Yeah, we want to get it all out. Yeah, I know. Okay, I know. It, so we know, can... the, the gun that I had, that he, he, he stole that. He stole it from the top of my closet with the bullets. When he turned around to shoot him, did Jeremy say anything? Like, no. There was, like, and I didn't even see it. Stop. Shot. Ow. Like, no. Or, like, oh, shit. No. Nothing. <laughs> nothing. Like, he had to have just completely off guard. I mean, oh, God. He didn't say anything. And Jeremy, I mean. Jeremy's a pretty mad yes, guy. Yeah. Yes, I think he'd be like, anything. what the fuck? Or... Yeah. I don't, I don't think there was any time for that. I think he'd. Any other discussion you what a stumper. Him, what a real tricky a situation this one is. Any other discussion you had with I'm him. starting to think there's some details that aren't true. Yeah. Yeah. Like somebody that involved is lying. To get so good give me that he didn't suffer it was quick. Hmm. Did he ever say anything about cleaning the inside of the car or the truck? Or... He said he did clean it all out because it was all cleaned up. So obviously that body gets found. When did you tell Jay that it was about the body and who it was or who you thought it was? I don't know. It's on my phone, I think. You text him about it? Well, I said that they, that is, or something about the bite in front of Cameron. Some they think about it was Mike and Jeremy, and he said it was something about. I hope to it is in your manner. Yeah, I think I saw that. Is that to kind of make it look like you? I don't know. Like I said, he didn't. Because you know he did it. Right. right. So. so I don't know. Like I don't know, but like he's been hanging around. Like Leslie's been there. He's been hanging around. So like, and he's. I had to play it off. He he played it off like he didn't know this guy. I don't know. And, so then I'm like, so I didn't know what I was supposed to do. So I just, I don't know. So, cause she was distraught about, you know, finding Jeremy. He was sick of us talking about Jeremy. Yeah, she told us that that kind of pissed him off. It pissed him off. And he said he got out and stormed out the one. Yeah, the one that he got. about the back seat and then talking about Yeah, Jeremy. cause she had brought it up before. And like, he's just, like she was, and she was talking to me, you know what I mean? Like, and I was like, "What is your deal? Like, what the fuck is your problem?" And he just checked off and left. Like you, like I had gotten drunk before, I guess, and I don't know. I apparently I hit him or something like that, and he got mad and he had stormed out, but he came back in, like, mm -hmm. and you know he came with us, ones. and he, you know like he stormed or whatever, I and mean, he, like, he never just got the fuck up and left, and. Just, just checked out. He was gone. I mean, then he didn't go to work the next day. Mm. And he left his phone with Leslie, and because they were the work was calling his phone, and she's like, "Well, he didn't go to work." Ah, uh, yes. And I was like, well, "That's not like him." Because hmm. so he was pissed. Yeah, he was mad. So how long did he keep that Tahoe after that? Um, he had just got that Mustang when we got pulled over. I don't, I don't know. I don't know what day that was. I don't that either. Was, yeah. it was... Up until that time, he still had the towel. Yeah. <laughs> Talk to the team. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna go talk to you. you wanna come with there? Do you need a bag of chips or anything? Are you hungry? Or... You sure? Okay. Yeah. I take a bag of chips. Are you kidding me? All right. I know you're gonna use my phone. Okay. But I've officially asked to have you sign this to give us permission to go through it. Are you okay Holy with that? Shit. Yeah. Okay, I'll send it here. The quality of this is crazy, dude. So your name goes at the top, your address, okay, and then your phone number. You may not know the make. Well, so basically just make, sign this, and, it, and it, we'll all it does is just say you're guilty. <laughs> and then you don't have to worry about anything. We'll handle it. Now that they have permission to search your phone, they'll search it for every Dumbass. bit of information from texts to location tracking yep. and web searches. Yep. Unless Hoth has been very, very careful. Not that she knows that they can do all that. Use against her. Because everybody has a phone and nobody knows how it works. Can I get a sodi? <laughs>
Yeah, can I have a Wawa, please? I need a Wawa with my chippies, please. Thank you. That's the phone number of the phone, right? Yeah. <clears throat> you can just put Bradley, B R A D L E Y, and Ludiker, L U D E K E R. And the make is a. Kyocera. Yeah, Kyocera. I don't know if it has a model. Oh, yeah, it does. Wow, it says Qualcomm at the bottom. The fuck? Why is this guy monologuing? Oh, wow, that's crazy. It's a car with a model? I can't believe it. Do you know each car has a model number? This is nuts. I just learned about this. I can't fucking believe it. Can you believe this shit? Oh, you're ready to go home? Oh, okay. She's ready to go home, guys. You think she should go home? She get minutes at the first every month or whatever. Yeah. Don't worry about this. There is no barricade around here. No, this one's not. Okay. I guess if you want to put the, this is the model, it's Qualcomm. Q U A L C O M M. Um, and then read all this, okay? Make sure you understand it. You don't have any problems reading or anything like that? Because if you do, I'll read it to you if you need me to read it to you for it. No, that's the witness part. You understand all that? Yeah. I right here. I don't think you do. And then you can put our names there again. And the dates, the ninth. And it is, it asks for the time. It's the bad. Oh, that's my number. Okay. Okay, give us a few minutes, okay? We'll be right back. Are you sure you don't need anything else? Okay, okay. Have someone come up with me so I can smoke. You want to smoke another yeah. cigarette? Just give me a second, okay? okay? All right, we're going to let you go out here and smoke just a sec. I got a couple of things for you, real quick. So you said he moved, right? Who moved? Jay moved. Did you say Jay no, moved? I don't need food or water. I just need no, the nice smell of cigarette to linger into my body and mouth for the rest of this ordeal, please. It's not very long because. Okay. Do you have any idea how long he's been living with his brother? Mm -mm. I don't know. So, do you, do you know where he was living when this happened? At his brother's. He was at his brother's? Yeah, he's been at his brother's all the time. No. Oh, okay. oh, so since at least November? Yeah. Oh, okay. yeah. And you think that's somewhere near the. It's Dunkin'? Been yeah, like. I've know. never been down there, so. Oh, I don't know if you go. Like, me, like, Brian. Mm -hmm. You go and turn right in the dum dum factors, like mm -hmm. I get right down there. Um, like the alley. I'm not really sure if it's like a street in the alley, I don't know, but. Um, and the, he's in the, in the alley, and it's, uh, I don't know, like the second house from before the next road. I'm not really sure. And he said his brother's name's Chris? Mm hmm. But you're not sure on his last name? No, I imagine it would be Clark. Okay. okay. Unless it's his stepbrother or something like this. Yeah. 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 Like Since you know him. Why do you say it like that? Yeah. Yeah. Step brother, Briz. Yeah. Yeah. And he told yeah. Him yeah. 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 Yeah.
took all the guns out of the house. He locked up his car. Yeah. Everything. So the brother's not there right now? No, he's in South Carolina. He's I think it's South Carolina. Hmm. When did his brother leave? I don't know. You don't know. But, like, I think they I don't know there. I assume they're his brothers. I don't know, but they were in his room, I guess. The guns were not secured so practically anyone could have had access to them. Can't believe There's it. There's also the important fact that Hoth was not legally able to own a gun no way. due to her criminal history. No way. And she and got access to a me, gun anyway? A gift How weird. For, like, but I thought there are like systems that. in place that are effective of keeping guns out of people who can't people. carry them yeah. legally. That's so weird. Guns, How could this have guns, happened? Yeah, in such a good country number. that they regulates guns right so right well, this is so weird. I wasn't paying attention. I, I can't know. believe it. Mm -hmm. yeah, and, I was, and I was drunk. Okay. And, you know, I was, right. you know, I was yeah. drunk. Okay. Is there anything else about any of this that you've left yeah, out? Dude. Phones? Not that I can remember. I don't, I mean, I believe that's everything. Yeah. I mean, if you ask a question, I'll go ahead and give the answer. I'm just, I'm just I kind of shocked. She would have told us this when we I know, I'm sorry. I just didn't know what to say. I'm so scared. I didn't know what to do. And then, like, and because I didn't say anything at the beginning, you know, because I didn't know what to do. I didn't know what to do after. No, like, I don't want to get in trouble either, but yeah, I didn't tell you, like, didn't tell yeah, you guys you're, you're right good. what happened. Yep. And one of the, one of them was like, I was just scared to death. I didn't uh -huh. know what to do. Yeah, you're totally not in trouble. Don't worry about it. I know what to do. Did you continue to just no trouble at and talk all. about my normal because you were scared or? Yeah. And like I didn't hang out with them as right. much. Here we go and again. Leslie, like she came over and she's been staying at my place. <laughs> she's been with us. And he doesn't like Leslie or? Um, <clears throat> he's kind of indifferent about her. He likes her okay. He likes her okay. All right. So you've been driving around with Leslie looking for Jeremy. And she has no idea what you know. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't know him. Like, I really <laughs> And then when it the said he'd seen him, and then Ellie, Ellie said he left with Ken Hammond's there. And I thought, Jesus really, Christ, he really did. He left okay. dude. He, 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 somewhere, and oh why are people God, saying he's seen him and he stop, see him, You know, like, I mean, you had to have some idea when he didn't say anything in the car after that, though, right? What do you mean? When Jeremy didn't say a word. Yeah. I mean, you had to. It's not like I, I met know Jeremy. I just well, wanted to. Jeremy is an yeah. animated guy. Yeah, I mean, yeah. yeah. He was so I didn't know Jeremy did. Yeah, I For sure. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Jeremy was like, You know, I guess I want to go back to if we get Jeremy. Losing my here, fucking mind over here. What is Jay going to say? I don't know if that's been know. apparent. I don't know. Is don't he going to say you planned it? I don't know. I don't know. This guy from what he... he no idea. Him. Had no idea. Shot him once. No idea. Had no idea. Before. He's clearly not in prison or hasn't been in prison for it. Right. He's gotten away with it before. Yeah. We just right, need to yeah. make sure that he's mm -hmm. not going to tell us something that you didn't tell us. What a conundrum. So if anything that... Well, thankfully, two people won't get away with it anymore. <laughs> Just like looks at her. <laughs> Out in the yard. They have enough for now. The detectives 18. and the interview. In October 2017, Ashley Hoth pleaded guilty to the murder of Jeremy Barrett. No way. On January 8th, 2018, Ow. she tried to withdraw her plea. No way. Claiming she was sleep deprived and intimidated while she was being questioned. As a part of the deal with the prosecutor's office, she agreed to testify against Clark, no way. but refused to do so. Her plea was not granted, no and way. she was convicted of second-degree murder no and way. sentenced to 25 to 40 years in prison. God damn. Maybe she'll learn how to lie in there. No way! You can't believe it! 